Ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, I exhort you and I say, and I do these videos, you know why? Because I really want to reach out to people. I really want to reach out to people because since I gave my life to Christ, um, he's been revealing stuff to me and the word of God has become so real that I really want to help people out to let them know. Seriously, brothers and sisters, ladies and gentlemen, seriously, we all going to die. We all going to die and we all going to have to present ourselves in front of Jesus Christ. And the only ones that are going to be saved is what Jesus Christ said. He's, Jesus Christ told his own disciple, I tell you, in Luke 13, 3, I tell you, if you do not repent, you will all like white perish. Brothers and sisters, ladies and gentlemen, Jesus Christ himself said, heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will not pass away. Listen, this is a man that used to be in the Bronx, like I said before, sniffing, drinking, fighting, cursing, watching pornography, in and out of jail. Listen, but when God filled me with his Holy Spirit, because I was looking for him, he opened up my eyes. Man, this is this is what I love. I love to read his word. His word is the truth. People get are gonna be so deceived. People gonna people think that if you don't look like a Christian, if if you don't look like a Christian, you're not a Christian. It's all backwards. Brother, God is not looking for your outside appearance. God wants to change your heart. It's, let me explain to you real quick what happened to me. Or what happened to all of us. We all by nature are like pigs that love to be in the mud, you know, we like to be inside the mud, we like to be inside the sin, inside the world, that's what it is, but what happened was when the Holy Spirit came in me seven years ago, it started changing my nature, you see, it started changing my nature, it, started, it, it turned me into a cat, now I'm like a cat, you ever seen a cat always trying to clean himself, that's how I be, I always want to be clean, so I, I don't want to be in sin, I want to be pure before God, I'll be... The Holy Spirit will change our nature. Today is the day of salvation. Tell them, ask them, tell them, give me your Holy Spirit. Want it, desire it. I'm telling you, it will change you. Don't worry about your outside appearance. God doesn't care about your outside appearance. God's looking for your heart so he could change it and your character and your ways. Brothers, do not be deceived, ladies and gentlemen. I exhort you because I love you. You know what? I told my family. I've been crying out to my family. Please come to God. Please don't go to hell. They got a, they're offended. They, you know why they're offended? Because I was the black sheep of the family. And now they feel like, wow, they know all the evil I've done. And now you're going to come and tell me what to do? <laughs> they're offended by that. But you know what? I didn't choose myself. Jesus chose me when I gave my life to him. And he's calling up upon everybody. He don't want no one to bury. If you just come to God and, and acknowledge, Lord, I don't believe in you or I'm having this problem. There is nothing he can't help you with. I'm telling you, he helped me with so everything almost. I can completely say... By the grace of God, I could really preach Romans 6, 14. No sin has dominion over me. For I'm not under the law, but I'm under the grace of God. This is a man that was watching pornography all his life. Women could pass by through me. Most beautiful women, I don't even look at it. And I'm not saying that I've been perfect in this area. The seven years I failed many of But I continue fighting, continue fighting, continue fighting. Because I want to be right with God. Because I love Him. Because I'm grateful for everything He's done. And I'm telling you, if you come to God Almighty, He presents His beautiful Son, Jesus Christ, and fill you with the Holy Spirit, you won't know what I'm saying. You won't want nothing else.